Hey guys, it's me, Jake, from JakeMan21642. Today I've got a video for you of this 2016 Nissan Versa SV sedan. This one is finished off in a metallic blue exterior, which is a very nice looking color on the Versa. I do apologize about the pollen on the vehicle. It was just washed two days ago, and it's just kind of unavoidable right now. But outside, you can see on the driver's side, you do have chrome door handles. Fuel cap is on the driver's side. And the SV does give you body colored mirrors. And overall, it's a very attractive looking little sedan. Around the rear, you can see your Versa and SV badges. As well as this one does have a lip spoiler installed, which looks very nice on it. Now, on the rear of the vehicle, the only way to open the trunk is from the key fob. There is no release inside. So you can just take the key, insert it right here, and pop it open. Or press and hold on the key itself, and it will open it up. Inside, you have a great amount of space. I mean, especially for a compact sedan like this. Really nice amount of room. It does include both of your carpeted floor mats, your Versa trunk mat, as well as underneath storage. And this one does even look to include the original window sticker. It does have your jack and everything else underneath. Up top, it is lined as well. Coming around to the passenger side of this Versa. This one is riding on a brand new set of Primewell tires that our shop put on it. I mean, they are brand new tires. They are the PS380s and they are 185-65 R15s, so you do have 15 inch steel wheels. This one does include your factory wheel covers on it. And same goes for up front. I mean, this vehicle has brand new tires all the way around. You have halogen headlights as well as your chrome grille. Does include your typical Versa key with lock, unlock, trunk release, and panic. Press and hold for panic, and as I showed, press and hold to release the trunk. Inside, this one does have the black cloth interior, which is in great shape. This is a very well appointed interior, too. The first thing I have to say stepping into the Versa is these seats are very comfortable, very supportive, and they're a pretty soft cloth as well. Start, insert the key. And inside you can see this one does have your standard steering wheel, audio system and Bluetooth phone controls on this side, cruise control over here, nice and light steering. And overall, the interior of this Versa, as I said, it is really well appointed for a, a car of this price range. On the door, you have some cloth around here, rubberized armrest. Your driver's side window is automatic, power windows, power locks, power mirrors up here. The dashboard is a rubberized material and you have this painted trim around here. In the middle, your uh, tachometer, speedometer, and then up top. You can see this one does have 40,000 miles on it, but that's really nothing to one of these. Headlight controls are over here, and then of course your wipers on this side. In the middle, hazard controls. Your audio system right here, which is nice and simple to use, and it's a good sounding stereo. <music> FM, AM, CD, and then USB and auxiliary in, your preset stations, and as I said, CD player up top. Down below, single zone manual climate control different zones, as well as your fan speed and your temperature right there, AC, defrost, and then your recirc. Two cup holders, and then this one does come with the CVT transmission or continuously variable. Drive, reverse, very simple. Back here, parking brake, as well as a 12 volt outlet, USB, auxiliary in, two cup holders, and some storage. The SV does give you an armrest for the driver, which you can move up and out of the way. Even that's nice and padded. I mean, really, these seats are comfortable in this car. Cloth in the middle, and it's a durable feeling material. Up top, you have your interior lighting, Bluetooth microphone, and mirror. You do get a vanity mirror on the driver's side as well. And then slide that out. It does have an extension. Overall, the interior of this car really is not a bad place to be, and it's just a nice, basic commuter, a great car that you won't have to think about or worry about at all. Driver's side window down, unlock all the doors. Over here too, you do have your traction control on and off, fuel cap release, and hood release. 
And then as I said too, there is not a uh, interior trunk release or one on the trunk itself. You just use the key. Fuel cap. And then inside of the rear seat of this Versa. Everything follows on the door with your cloth and everything else. The seats are the same nice comfortable cloth back here. And they do fold down so you can access the trunk or use it as a pass through. And stepping in, I mean, this is probably one of the nicest parts about the Versa in its class is just the amount of interior space you get. I mean, this would be a great car for hauling people. You can easily fit two adults comfortably in the back seat. Great car for Uber, Lyft, something like that, or just a commuter. But like the like I said, the back seat's the same comfortable cloth as up front. The seats fold. We have handles on the side. And a back seat pocket on the passenger side. Everything follows through over here. And up front does have a manual passenger seat. Inside of the glove box. This one does include all of the original owner's literature, which has never even been taken out of the original packaging, but all in here does even include the wallet, as well as your state inspection certificate. Your air vents can open and close like that. the headlights on and as I said I really do apologize about the amount of pollen on this vehicle it's just unavoidable at this time of the year but you can see halogen headlights and then under the hood this one does have Nissan's 1.6 liter four-cylinder everything under here is in great shape this is a nice reliable engine Bring the automatic driver's side window back up. Put it off right here. We'll try them. Might need to turn the headlights off. And as always, this Versa is for sale at Volvo of Richmond here in Richmond, Virginia. If you are interested in this vehicle, please let Volvo of Richmond know you saw this video. Thanks for watching.